We're talking throttle adjustments today. If you have a Honda engine on your Triumph, Matt, the most qualified, because he touches these things every second of every day. Hey, um, let's talk about that, Matt. Let's say uh, you squeeze your throttle and you can't get 3450. Let's say you only get 32. Now, of course, there's an adjustment here, correct? Right. right. And whether you're at 32 or even, say, 3340, mm -hmm. uh, this will will raise your adjustment the farther that's adjusted out however it only does it by small increments and you'll notice in time that cable will wear and you'll have to continue to adjust that since this one's already adjusted out pretty far uh i'm going to start by running that nut in and then i can take that whole assembly and then tighten that in you don't have to go all the way in but you do want to just give yourself enough to uh, adjust it later on. And then we're going to move downward because we're going to do cable adjustment down here. You're going to remove your air cleaner cover. Yep. Look how fast you are. You've done this a couple of times, haven't you? Handful of times, yeah. <laughs> All right, so I got a number two Phillips, and I'm just going to loosen that here. And then once you're down here, you can adjust that out. The farther, the farther you go in this way, uh, the lower the RPM is going to go. And the farther that you pull it uh, to the right-hand tank, uh, the higher the RPM is going to go. So you just get it where you want it. Normally, I like to go a little below 3450 because this will raise the RPM by a lot. Uh, it's it's kind of difficult to hit it right exactly where you need it. So, but once you get it close, you can come up to the top by the lever again over here. Yeah, and, and dial it in there. Dial it in a little bit. So what I'll do is take that out. And again, the farther you adjust this nut out, uh, the higher the RPM is gonna go. So once you got it to where you like it, you can just run this nut all the way in and just lightly take a pair of needle nose and just kind of tighten that nut up on the lever and that way that'll keep your uh, RPM setting. There you go, high-end throttle adjustment. While we're here, let's tell everybody where the low-end idle screw is. Yeah, so that's the black screw right here. Phillips. Yes, again, number two Phillips. And the farther uh, that you go counterclockwise, the lower uh, the bottom end RPM is gonna be. And the more you go clockwise, the higher that bottom end RPM is gonna be. There you go. High and low throttle adjustments on the Honda. We're gonna do a separate video too for the Vanguard because concept's the same, but slightly different. Hey, watch all the YouTube videos. We've got them online right now, a bunch of them. And if you need parts, you know where to get those now. Go to permagreen.com. Thanks, Matt.